first <clears throat> first obviously is the is one's own home obviously we are happy in our home so that's the first one second is fortunate born okay then third is being at the right place being in the right places that makes us happy at the right time then we have um being with friends of course that makes us happy then we have wherever luck favors okay we are lucky that makes us happy then we have being in um uh, among beautiful things or having a uh, being among um, beautiful scenery for example right then the last one is wealth so <clears throat> being with the uh, influential so obviously things um are much better with you know influential people around in the sense in the material sense uh, which is uh, you know obvious so for example if you have some chief minister or somebody coming nearby your place then you find that things are getting neater people and roads are being made better so things like that so that certainly has some influence or an impact on on our own uh, living now what i am trying to do is uh, map these to corresponding things with respect to planets so one's own home is like the planet is in one's its own house we we have seen that planets are lots of different houses so they each planet has its own house as well so that's one place where the planet is really happy then fortunate born this is like um i have just taken specific example where some planets if they are occurring in pairs then it means something sometimes it means really good so that's why i've chosen that here then being at the right places so some planets for example if they are if sun is in aries then it's much better than being in its own home so with there it's matching with its fire sun is fiery fiery so it's matching with the aries which is fire element and uh, that's like being in the right place then with friends so we have some planets are more friendly with other planets okay but some planets are considered enemies then we have where luck favors that means some houses are considered lucky um for example kendra houses you have done the homework lakshmi houses so those are lakshmis for fortune so fortunate so some houses are lucky where the planets will be happy then we have beautiful views so here there is a concept called directional strength that that means sometimes the planets if they are you know uh, they aspect some in a specific direction some other house so they get strength in that then we have um i mean astronomically it will be like planet in specific degrees or directions then with the influential so this is for example if you have uh let's say jupiter jupiter is the you know the, the most um, you can say auspicious or benefic planet so if it is like you know in some uh, or aspecting some other house with some other planet then that influence can be seen so jupiter's influence will be seen so that's what i'm trying to indicate here so the uh, take away from this is that <clears throat> there are certain um you can say combinations permutations where the planets are more happy or rather when i say happy they'll give more effect okay that's what i'm trying to say here so as long as you can register this thing in mind that there is some connection with this that is sufficient for now and i think these visuals will um, help you to connect so let's proceed to the audio 